So we invite you to love the game with us from Cary, North Carolina, Florida State in white, Stanford in black. Will that translate into success on this national championship stage? Montoya, some space in the box for a shot that glances off wow. the crossbar. Yep, and it's a great start from Stanford. So far, the initial pressure on Dudley, not allowing her time and space once she does collect the ball. At Jagini, Olsen off the post. And here is Nesbitt, taking it off the foot of Kitahara. Driven ball, just at the top of the area. Dudley is tripped up. Penalty kick on the way for Florida State. One for one on the season. Dudley to give Florida State the lead. She got it. Yay! Florida State. But we were just talking about the positioning of Nesbeth in terms of the buildup. I think she's actually spot on with staying out of the play, allowing Flynn Gilcrest. Here comes Jody Brown of Florida State again. It's in a row for the Seminoles. time to score a goal right after you scored the first one and here it is how quickly Florida State can get into the attack one big ball over the top Brown starts it she gets it back and my goodness what a finish not easy it's bouncing it's at pace but look at that first touch and then the second one in the back of the net be disciplined defensively meaning can they win the ball higher up the field because right now this allows Ike into the box, a chance for Stanford. Roque is out. The Cardinal, Doms, has the shot. Yeah. And the goal! The exact point I was trying to make is if this Florida State team takes their foot off the gas. This Stanford team is not going to let up. I felt like Ike could have taken her chance there, but then it allows for Doms to come up. She's not going to miss from that. That positioning, great first touch to set herself up right there, buy herself some time, just tucks it into the corner. Roque is screened in the end, gets a little bit of a fingertip, can't keep it out of the back of the net. And we said Stanford have to get the next goal to be able to cut this lead in half. But the one goal conceded in the 52nd minute by Maya Doms, making this a one goal game. Dudley, making her way into the box, looking to set up the other side, save! We see what she can do on both sides of the ball defensively in good positions to be able to affect the play and not allow Florida State to gain any momentum, but then also what she can do in the attack. Watch out here, Olsen off the ball from Dudley. Olsen! Florida State retakes the two goal lead! Florida State. Chase this game, well what does that do? It opens up the space in behind, and what a first time ball that is from Dudley to understand where the space is, but then look at that touch from Olsen. It sets her up perfectly, cuts off the angle for Wesley to be able to make the play defensively. And then this player right here, who's typically a center forward for Florida State, been moved out wide right. Well, from this position, she is not going to miss. So clinical, just slots it to the far post, gives a little bit of separation in this game. Three to one, Florida State. On that Olsen goal in the 58th minute. Here is Olsen. Finding some room to move, has Brown, that's where she goes, Brown! Give her another! Florida State on fire in the national championship! To be able to defend, once there's time and space for these front runners, the attacking five for Florida State, it's always gonna be so difficult to defend. You see Olsen with the presence of mind, first touch, takes the space, right pass, Right weight of the pass into Brown. And there's some question marks for the goalkeeping of, of Campbell. She anticipates to go one way. And then much like we saw 
And that first goal for Brown in the first half puts it the other way of Campbell. There's the dive from Campbell. Brown goes the other way. Her second of the night, fourth for Florida State. And it's gonna be a big challenge now for Stanford to come back from this deficit. Taylor Huff back onto the field for Florida State. Olsen acrobatically keeping this in play for the Seminoles. Still in the box, and Jagini adds another! Goal! Florida State. Tonight, this is her 16th, and it just starts with the acrobatic play that you mentioned, but just regaining possession, putting Stanford under pressure, getting numbers around the box, Echigini keeping it alive, and just testing your luck a bit. Just a half chance. So you can see the, the last ditch defending from Stanford keeps it alive, and then Echigini, just a little bit of a, a ricochet to find its way into the back of the net, testing her luck, as I mentioned, and that would be the fifth of the night for Florida State Seminoles, and what a night it has been. And we've Florida talked so State much about how dominant they have been. State well, tonight is no different. And four is five for Florida State as the Seminoles win their fourth Your national championship, meeting the Stanford Cardinal tonight. Congratulations to Florida State, the 2023 Division I Women's Soccer National Champion.